Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Selenium Tech Automation. In this video, I am going to discuss about what are all the different types of app driver commands we have inside our Selenium Automation tool. Okay, before going to automate any web based application, everyone must and should have to know what are all the different types of web driver commands we have inside our Selenium tool. Okay, so there are various okay there are various methods which are available in our web driver interface okay using of the driver instance variable we are going to access all these methods through our which variable driver instance variable okay with the help of driver dot method name we are going to use all the methods which are available inside this web driver interface okay so to check all these methods so let me open our eclipse before that first let me discuss about what are all the different commands which are offering by the selenium web driver okay under that we can categorize at browser level commands and also navigation level commands and also web element level commands so these are all the three different levels of commands where we are going to use to automate any application so first we will see about what are all the different browser commands here okay so let me open so here you can see the get command and get title command get current url command get page source command close command and quit quit command okay so these are all the six commands which will present at browser level commands only so these six commands which are present inside our browser commands so now let me discuss one by one the first command here is get command okay so for that let me open get i mean eclipse so from there i will show you what exactly this get command will do here okay so what exactly this get command will do here so as i mentioned already okay as i mentioned already with the help of this driver instance variable that is called as driver i am going to put some dot operator here if i mention driver dot means automatically this web driver is giving all these commands okay as we have discussed so there are three levels of commands the first one is which one browser level commands the next one here is navigation related commands and the next one here is web element level commands okay so now i am discussing about browser level commands okay so inside that if i mention here driver dot okay driver dot we are getting few methods right so now our command here is get command okay so let me type get so here you can see it is giving one method saying that get of string url okay so here get is the method name and string is the parameter that is called as data type and url okay which is data type of string type so then this method is not returning anything okay this method is a white type it is not returning anything okay it is not returning anything so but this method is accepting one parameter that is called as get string of url okay with the help of this get method i am going to launch my application to launch your application the method what we are using here is that is called as get method okay that is called as get method so now let me type here get string url so as it is a string data type and also it is accepting only one parameter so we have to define our which one http s www dot google dot com okay so this is my url okay with the help of get method i am going to launch my application that is called as google dot com okay so this why why we are using this get method means it is used to launch our application url in a current browser window okay so now let me execute this program we will see whether our application is launching or not okay so it is launching our web driver now that is called as edge driver okay edge browser it is launching currently after that with the help of driver instance variable we are using here one method that is called as get method so where it is accepting one parameter saying that get of string url okay get of string url as you can see so now i can able to launch my application so that is the purpose of this particular get command so next we will discuss about our next command that is called as get title command okay so as we have already launched our application just now if i want to get this particular application title okay whatever the url i have launched just now i want to get that particular title so how we can get means with the help of get title method okay with the help of get title command we are going to get our current 
application title okay so how we can get the same way after getting our url i am going to use driver okay driver dot get okay driver dot get title you can see here driver dot get title so what exactly this driver dot get title will do here means it will retrieve the currently opened browser url title okay currently open browser url title so whatever the url i have opened it will return me the title of that particular page so here also it is accepting only one parameter that is called as string type okay it is called as string data type and it will return you the title of the current page and it will return you the title of the current page okay so this is the use of this get title method so let me take this one so now if i want to print this particular title so with the help of CISO statement we are going to okay first i need to store into some string data type okay string title equals to driver dot get title okay string title equals to driver dot get title because it will return you string data type right so that's why i am storing into one string related variable i initialized one variable of data type string so now i am going to store this captured title into you this particular string variable that is called as title so now let me print the title here CISO statement of what is our title title of the current page is what title of the current page is my concatenate title okay so now it will print you the what is the title of your current page okay so now let me execute we will see okay it is launching the browser and it is launching our application as well so once that is done it is going to print our title of the current page okay so here you can see i think it is printing currently saying that title of the current page is google okay the title of the current page what we have launched here the title is google here you can see here it is showing google okay here it is showing google so now if i want to get the current url okay if i want to get the url for of the current page means so how we can get with the help of there is one more command that is called as driver dot get current url so it is also representing a string data type only and also it will return you the url so where is your currently browser open okay where the browser is opened currently it will return you the current url of that particular application what you have launched so get current url okay so now in the same way how we did for get title method in the same way i am going to do for printing the url of the current page okay current url okay current url so now let me do CISO statement of okay current url is okay current url is how current url okay current url right current url so now let me execute so let me before that let me close the previously opened browser instances so that we can execute it one more time so this time it will print us the title of the current page and also title of i mean current url of our current browser okay it is going to launch our application now and then it is going to print our current url as well you can see here so whatever the url i mentioned here okay whatever the url i mentioned here i am able to print with the help of get current url okay for example there is one more command if you want to get the page source of this particular web page that is called google so how we can see the page source here you can see right click on if your uh, page so then you can see one view page source if i want to print all this information so there is one more method that is called as which one get page source okay with the help of get page source method we are going to get all the page source which are available for that particularly currently opened page okay for this particular page i am going to getting the page source okay so what we are getting here so now for this uh, for that what is the method name here the same way driver dot get page source 
here you can see it is also not having any parameter but its return type is which one string data type and it will it will loads the I mean it will loads the currently opened page source okay it will get the details of the browser the URL what you have launched it will take all the page source from that particular page okay so for that get page source is my method name okay so now in the same way I am going to print inside my console so how we can print so let me store inside one string data type variable that is called as page source okay that is called as page source okay page source so now I am going to print okay now I am going to print in the same way how we make it for getting the title and getting the current URL okay so now here we can concatenate with page source because the captured page source we are going to store inside our page source string variable right so current loaded page source is page source is what okay so now let me execute this program and we will see whether it is printing all the details or not so this time it will print the entire page source which are available for that particular page where we are going to open now okay browser got launched application is also launching with the help of driver.get method url also is going to be launched with the help of okay everything is done now now let me check our console here you can see it is printing all the page source which is loaded just now okay so this is all our page source if you want you can check from your page source also by right clicking on your current page and view page source okay here we can see okay here we can see it is printing all the information inside our which one inside our console okay here we can see try catch try catch everything everything is available here so this is how we can print our page source in the console part this is how we can get our current url for the current application which we opened on our current browser okay so then once it is done if i want to close my browser okay if i want to close my browser so how we can close means there is one more method that is called as driver dot close there is one more method that is called close method so here driver dot close so what does this driver dot close method will do means if suppose for example if you have uh, more than two to three windows so during that time if you use this driver dot close method means it will close the currently opened browser where the driver focus is available for example my driver focus is available on third window so after the third window driver focus if i use driver dot close method means automatically it is going to close the third window instance only okay so let me execute this program it is going to close the current browser window because here we have only one opened browser window if we want to close all the browser session means there also we have one more method that is called as driver dot quit okay that method name is called as driver dot quit with the help of driver dot quit method we can close our current browser session and also current browser instance okay here you can see it is opened and it is closed okay i forget to observe let me execute it one more time and we will see okay so now our browser is going to be launched okay and then it is going to get the url with the help of get method after that what happened driver dot close why okay one second it is giving some error here let me check what type of error throw connection socket exception okay so everything is passed that error is not related to this particular concepts okay let me execute it from testng.xml file we will see whether it is reflecting if we executed with testng or not okay so this is how the browser commands will work here so these are all the browser level commands only what we have discussed so far okay what we have discussed so these are all related to the browser level commands only okay the first command here is what driver.get so where we can launch our application with the help of get method at the same time if you want to get the title of the 
page means with the help of get title method we can retrieve the title of that particular page at the same time if you want to get your current url for your current window so with the help of get current url at the same time if you want to close your currently opened browser window you can use this driver.close method okay so so far we have discussed about these commands so where which are related to our browser level commands so after this we have navigation commands as well such as navigate to command back command and forward command okay so navigate to commands means it will navigate from one application to another application if i want to navigate from google application to facebook application means we can use this navigate to command again if i want to go back to my google application means with the help of back command we can switch from facebook application to google application in the same way this forward command will also work it will uh, forward to the next application from current application to next application so then web elements commands so there are many commands we have like click command get text command and also we have uh, get window handle so likewise there are many commands we have inside this particular web element commands but we will discuss about these two commands in our next video okay so thank you so much guys until then take care everyone have a nice day signing off selenium tech automation thank you guys